What kind of stuff y'all showing us? What's this? Another Dragon Quest game or something? Castlevania? That's cool, I guess. Like, Transylvanian? Transylvanian Monster Hunter? I don't really play Monster Hunter, so I mean, that looks pretty badass, but it's pretty cool dragon design. I'm not even gonna hold you. That's pretty sick. Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. Oh, that's the other. That's actually one of the Monster Hunters I was kind of interested in. That's like the East Asian style Monster Hunter. I mean, that's on. How you doing? Nintendo Man, they really be doing it up with this Monster Hunter stuff. Let me say it. The, the updates and everything for Monster Hunter is wild, man. Ever since Monster Hunter World, everything they've been doing with Monster Hunter has been crazy. From what I heard, they've been doing good with Monster Hunter for years. Even before World. In the Mario Party Superstars game. Oh boy. Was that a Mecha? Bowser head? Yo, let me get that game where I get to play as Malka, Mecha Bowser. Look, I don't have friends, so I can't play this, okay? I don't play Mario... What is this, Mario Party? It's nice looking, though. It's probably fun to watch people who are drunk play this game. Oh, well, they're, they're doing their best to be Chris Redfield. <laughs> Punch that boulder! I bet Rosalina's the best at that. Hmm. Yu-Gi-Oh? Welcome to Voice of Cards. Almost kind of sounds like Yugi if he was old. Oh, wait a minute. I think I recognize that art style. Isn't that the same guy who did Dragon Guard 3? And, uh, Terror Battle? I can't remember his name. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's him. That visual style looks very much like his. That's his name. Kimihiko Fujisaka. There it is. So Yoko Taro's a part of this as well. So it, so this is like Dragon Guard. They, they teamed up again. So how you handle them changes how the things progress. That, that makes sense. That's pretty cool. Did he just swing on that dude? Wow, that was like watching the Dark Knight Rises choreography. Although I don't know if this is a, a, a expansion of the previous Musou Zelda game, or is this a brand new game you have to buy separately? I do like that I think you get to play as the Guardians, right? I want to play as, what's, what's homegirl's name, Barbosa? Barbarossa? Chick with the big nose and the big hips. I want to play as her. Oh my lord. <laughs> or maybe them. What is going on here? Okay, that looks pretty fun. Is that Chocobo, Chocobo Racing? Never Start played Chocobo Racing. Can I play as like Cloud or Squall like or Lightning? This is kind of fun. Is this like a remake or is this actually like a legit new one? Okay, I kind of want to play that. Doom spells, Fire Fira, Draga. That's kind of fun. Big ass fireball. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at the stages. Wow, look at Gilgamesh. That might be the one, I might have to pick him. I like that Ichoko has like the, the the jet set radio skates. That's cool. Why does it feel like the last one wasn't that long ago? To it. Dystopian world, post-apocalyptic, but very colorful. Okay. It's your new adventure, Kirby. Go off and explore in this dangerous island. It's, it's I Am Legend starring Kirby instead of Will Smith. Gotcha. I'm not even a Kirby fan. Never played a Kirby game. But I Am, I am Legend Kirby? I think you guys are onto something. Listen, I don't know anything about this except that I think Pauline is in it and she, oh there she is, and now it's tights, and that's the only thing I care about is how she wearing them tights. That's the only thing that matters. The only reason I play it is because Pauline's in it and she's wearing them tights. Wow, this looks not recent. Old Republic. What was that? Like the GameCube? I'm going to guess it was GameCube. It literally looks like GameCube right here. This looks like GameCube, which is not bad for its time, actually. Or was this like Xbox? Oh, it's got that, um... What's that game that Square Enix came out with? Octopath Traveler look. You have gone to the one place I cannot follow. In response to the I cannot follow you, demo release, Princess Cordelia, please. With a focus on elements that received lots of feedback. These include adjustments to the difficulty, improvements to on-screen visuals, camera angle controls, can do that the ability before, to review okay. previous dialogue. Come on, man, that's just basic stuff. Come on, guys. streamlined game flow and loading times. When you're playing a game that has like old pixel graphics, sprites in it, you don't expect long load times, so, you know. Oh, here we go, Metroid. Oh, I mean, I forget about Metroid, uh, what is this, Dread? Metroid 5. Actually, right? That's so cool. I always loved, like, fusion look, and now they've come back with, like, a pseudo-fusion look. It's so dope. I definitely want to play this. Nemesis design looks so badass in this game, man. Let's go, girl. Show them what you could do. Show them what you could do. Oh my. Uh, I think you 
up. I think I think you, I think you messed the wrong one. This looks dope, man. I'm all about it. If Talk about new age of gaming. Any <laughs> online member. Fifty bucks for some old ass control. <laughs> hope you look forward to this new membership. That's cool, plan. I guess. I mean, you, what, there's nothing really left. Like Smash Brothers is happening later. Cyberpunk you already showed me Metroid Dread. RPGs. That was really it. I'm always just curious to see what Nintendo's up to, life. man. That's why I watch these things, narratives. see what they got going on. Ah, uh, yeah, I know people love Castlevania. I can't say I know much about Castlevania, although I did watch the anime, which was excellent. That was a big-ass sword. Dude got the ultimate weapon? Act Razor of Renaissance. Oh, wow. Actually, it looks kind of cool. It also kind of looks like Ivan Ooze. <laughs> From that old Power Rangers movie. Alright, I'm not a big fan of the animation style. It's got that old PlayStation 1 claymation movement style. I'm not a big fan of that. Oh, did she just blow up a village? Oh, so it's like a, a 2D action platformer style deal mixed with... Tower defense elements? That's interesting. I like the artwork. The cover art's really dope. I think his nose is crooked. I think you got a crooked nose, bear person. They got the music down. Added the, the visuals are a little nicer. Delt. Delta room? One and two. Is that what that says? In making a full-length animated Mario movie for the big screen. How did this take so long? I feel like this should have been a thing years ago. I also wanted to reveal our key cast members who will be voicing Mario and his friends in the movie. Okay. First, of course. <laughs> who will be played by Chris, Chris Pratt? Pratt? He's so cool. Look at this, look at this dude, Mario man. Will be talking a lot in the movie. Man. Please look he really Mario grew up. He looks so handsome now, man. I still remember him in Parks and Rec, man. And he was just a giant Next, man baby. Princess Peach will be played by oh Andy my Taylor goodness. They're just getting the most beautiful people. You're not even going to be able to see their faces. Peach. Oh my goodness. Mario's little brother, Luigi, will be <laughs> Charlie Day. <laughs> I'm excited for you Why is this cracking me up right now, man? I could totally see this. I could totally see this happening. That's Bowser This is great. Oh my Jack goodness. I'm they had too much fun with this casting. By Jackson. They had too much fun with this casting. Oh no. Keegan, Look at that. Be playing Toad. <laughs> I'm looking forward to great comedic moments. Uh, what? Even though this is a Mario movie, Donkey Kong will You already know Toad's going to get more voice lines now. Will be played by Seth Rogen. <laughs> that I makes so much sense. Holy crap. Donkey Kong by Seth's son. He basically is Donkey Kong. <laughs> and of course, these are Charles great. Martinet. Who has voiced Mario and Mario I want to see the movie now more than ever. Games over the years is also involved. He's a classic. And will be of course you could not have him involved. In the movie. I want to see the movie now more because of the casting. It's just like with with Pikachu, Detective Pikachu and Ryan Reynolds. It made me want to see the movie just because of the casting. Characters. Wow, that is that's all I can that's so funny. About the Mario movie. This is a very That's all I needed, Miyamoto song. I went from kind of like whatever to like now I'm excited. Can you imagine Toad freaking? Oh my goodness. What the heck? You know he's gonna be talking so much. Shit. <laughs> oh my goodness. I never got into Splatoon. I kind of wanted to. It looked fun, but I never, I never got into it. Never ended up playing it. What happened? Ew, what's that? Ew. What is that? Is that a piece of a tentacle, but it's furry from an octopus? Why? I've been These guys are just a bunch of characters, the boy. Minasan. <laughs> Konnichiwa. What you just saw I am Mr. Cool Guy Scientist. From you can tell because of my sunglasses and lab coat. <laughs> oh, so that's why there's squids on land? They evolved to take over the land now? Is that what happened? Is that why that tentacle is furry? It's like a furry cat squid abomination? Ew. Please look forward to... Splatoon 3. Oh man, Japanese comedy. This is the last trailer we have to show you today. Oh, that's it. Take a look. All right, what y'all got? Platinum. Wait a minute. Hold up. 101. Yo, don't mess with me now. This is another Astro Chain. The monster designs are pretty dope. Man, y'all getting wrecked. Of course y'all getting wrecked, man. Y'all standard military. Y'all really thought y'all was going to handle it. Whatever this is. 
Come on now, just give it up. Oh no! Don't tell me. What the heck is that? <gasps> no! You can't be serious! There she is! Woo! Bad boy. The purple guns! Oh my god! Show her to me. Wow! It seems I'm unfashionably late. Oh, you are, but it's okay. She's beautiful. Oh my god, you made us wait. I thought you were gone. I thought we lost you. Oh, gameplay. Show me this, bro. Show it to me. Look at the effects. What is happening? She just tortured them all. Yo, listen to the music, bro. What, did she just devil trigger? Oh my goodness, bro. She Look, the hair bow. That is magnificent. Hit him with that stuff, girl. Oh my goodness, it's been so long. Oh my goodness, look at all the extra flash. What's good, Gamora? Wow, wait, what is happening? Are you actually, this is what I hoped they would do. Are you kind of like controlling it? Oh my, what the, this is like some bullet witch type of shit. Look at this. Look at this. What? Oh my god, what is the... Bro, you can't be serious. Oh my god. <laughs> they did it. They did it. They did it. They finally did it. They finally freaking did it. 2022. Oh my god, they finally did it. What happened? What happened? What's going on? Who the heck is... John? Who's that? What you just saw was the latest trailer for Bayonetta 3. Oh my god, just hearing him we say it. This game in 2017. Yes, you did. Thank you for your patience. Oh my god. I thought you abandoned us. We hope you look forward to Bayonetta's new encounter. Oh, I can't wait. Y'all need to hurry fuck up. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please. <laughs> That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. <sighs> Thank you for watching. What a way to end it. They knew what they was doing. They knew what they was doing. They saved the best for last, bitch. Oh, 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 oh. Mm, Nintendo. Y'all, y'all knew what y'all was doing.